Ohm's law V equals IR shows the relationship between voltage, current, and resistance. So this means that if we have one of the uh, two of these three things, we are able to find out the other one. So in this circuit here, we've got a 10 volt power supply and two resistors. One is 1.5k ohms and the other is 1k ohms. So we can work out the current in this quite easily because we know the resistance and the voltage. So if we work out the total resistance, so RT is equal to 2.5 kilo ohms, we're able to use V equals IR and rearrange that to find I in this case, so our current. So that means that I is equal to V on R, which is equal to 10 on 2.5 times 10 to the 3. So that comes out to equal 0.004 amps or 4 milliamps. So you can, as you can see, it's quite easy to find one of these elements if we only know two of them. From this, we can work out the voltage across one of these resistors. So that shows the way that you can work out voltage in this. So we know our current's 4 milliamps. We know our resistance of, say, if we want to find V1. So the voltage across this resistor here. So V1 is equal to IR, which is equal to 4 times 10 to the minus 3. So that's our 4 milliamps that we worked out that goes through this whole circuit, times 1.5 times 10 to the 3, which is this resistance here. So that comes out to equal 6 volts. So that shows our voltage drop across this resistor. So as you can see, it's quite easy to find our voltage. And we could do the same for resistance if we knew our current and our voltage, which just works the same way. So that would be R equals V on I.